Hey guys, got to another brand new video on on gaming, and today we are doing another reaction to another video like what we did with the Spider Mask, except for this time it's random ginger crazy against Pokemon ginger pleb. I have no clue what the hell he is, but let's get into the video, guys. Now, first of all, I just want to say I am I the first saw this, I died with laughter. So I thought, you know, what else going on, on the internet? Finding some more cancerous videos. Let's just find like another video. While I'm searching, browsing the random internet. So while I'm browsing, I find this video. So I hope you guys do enjoy this and let's watch this together. Nah, I'm not leaving you. Roll clip. I don't understand why everyone thinks making Pokemons in real life is a good idea. Mimo, you know what they're trying to do? They're trying to take Pokemon from the game, from the old show, and make them real. Do you realize how dangerous that actually is? Do you realize that I have a lot of guns? I'm not worried about it. Yeah, Mima, but I don't think a gun is gonna help us when a Pikachu comes and tries to shoot a sign your at us! <laughs> Surely, he has to know Pokemon Go is digital, right? And not like real life Pokemon? And surely this also has to be a troll. Like, he's trying to tell his Mima, or whatever you call it in America, saying that a gun isn't gonna do anything about Pikachu attacking them. Surely this has to be a troll. If it isn't, I don't even know at this point what the internet is. However, I mean, come on. Like, surely, you can't actually think. He doesn't know it's digital, right? Anyway, let's continue the clip. What the hell is a Pikachu? A Pikachu is like a mouse that can shoot 20,000 volts of electricity into your ass. I'll shoot his ass. You know, all the people that call you a Snorlax, that's a Pokemon, by the way. I love how he's ranting about this to his Mima, and his Mima's just kind of going along with it, doesn't know what it is, like, I'll oh, shoot his that. ass, and like, and then, hang on, hold up, hold up. People call his grandma Snorlax, but those of you that don't know what a Snorlax is, here's an image of a Snorlax. Yeah, how? <laughs> Continue. I'm just gonna blow the ass off with my gun and not worry about it, and neither should you. Alright, <laughs> first of all, this guy's been talking for like 40 seconds. How the hell does he sound like he's out of breath, like he's been jogging for six hours? Wait, <laughs> oh my god. Like, what is this guy on, man? Just, just look at him, he's like stressing the hell out. Just calm, calm the hell down, dude. <laughs> Continue the clip. I mean, Mimo, they're talking about bringing something called uh, reality, a virtual thing. Like they're bringing it into the real world. Like, like they, like they're building some kind of machine that literally takes Pokemon's and brings them into the real world. Like I remember playing with the car game as a kid, and like it was a fun game. Like I didn't really play it, you know. I was, I was always playing stuff like Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> Like, I knew how to play that game, <laughs> but, <sighs> I gotta, <sighs> like, I just, I didn't realize that people were so stupid. Like, you were all thinking that this is a good idea. Oh, uh, hmm, I don't know. What happens when someone gets hit by a tar when they're chasing a Pokemon? And they just don't chase the Pokemon because I can clearly see outside their phones. I mean, what happens to me, Mo? When somebody's going, oh, let me, uh, let me go uh, look for a Pokemon. Oh, here's a Snorlax. Oh, uh, ah! Like, that's not funny. I'm My Meemaw's not a Snorlax, first of all, okay? <laughs> Dude, watch all the comments in, like, his video. Probably be like, oh, your Meemaw's a Snorlax and stuff. Dude, like, first of all, no one would have probably thought of that if we didn't bring it up. Like, surely, there's no, there's no way. It can't be that stupid. This has got to be a troll. Continue the clip. That's not funny! Ah! Okay. It just, it, it irritates me. I'm telling you all now, this whole Pokemon Go thing, you know, the Pokemon Go, oh, I mean, I mean there are comments like, and today's the day Pokemon took over the world. Yeah, but they're thinking that it's a Nintendo game. You know, I mean, it's actually going to be Pokemon taking you over the world! <laughs> Wait, hold up. He thinks Pokemon are actually going to take over the world? Once again, I repeat, it's digital. <laughs> like, honestly, from what I've seen, it's just on the phone. You look through your phone, mate. Just, just stop. Also, 
if this guy reminds you of someone, his voice. If you guys, if you ever watched, if you ever, if you, if, you, if you've ever watched Community, you'll know. But uh, if you haven't, then I'll just put this guy up for you. He's one of the characters called Garrett. He speaks so much like I'll just put him on, and then we'll finish the clip. Continue. Right. Yeah. Let's begin. Ready. Set. Peace. <laughs> Crisis alert! A civil war has broken out in Ethiopia! Rebel forces have seized the grain supply, creating a humanitarian disaster! Crisis alert! A tsunami has hit Vietnam! Massive flooding has alert. left seven in Ghana! Crisis alert! Tuberculosis outbreak! Crisis alert! Humanitarian aid, we further resolve disarmament treaty. Crisis alert! To help women and children get save the orphans! Loose nuke sinkhole! North Korea! The Prime Minister in Emissary! We did it. You're a fool. Tell me guys, let me know down in the comments, does it sound like him, does it not sound like him? In my opinion, the guy that was saying Chrysler sounds like the changer. Anyway, let's continue the actual original clip. Hope you guys enjoy the video and let's get to it. Someone should start a petition to ban this right now! No, they shouldn't. You, ha you people have no idea what you're doing. Just remember, I said it first. Ginger, I'm proud of it. So in conclusion, guys, don't forget, pack up all your bags, pack up all your clothes, prepare for the apocalypse, camp out in your houses, turn on each other, eat each other, camp out in your doomsday bunkers, and prepare for the Pokemon, Pokemon take over ink of the world. Because obviously these virtual things that we see on our phones are going to take over the world. And also, guys, don't forget, in conclusion, another thing we need to remember is that the changer said it first, and we need to sign a petition to ban this app that's going to be returning. So anyway, hope you guys did enjoy this video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more content. If you did enjoy this content, I will see you guys in the next one. Let me know if you want me to do more videos like this, because I really enjoy doing videos like this. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. You know I try so hard, but I think you don't see because I'm moving so fast. We